Hello everyone, we're the Hobby Farm Guys. I'm Steve, sitting next to me, that's Brian. And as always, Eric is behind the scenes with his finger on the pulse of everything fashionable and trendy. Hey, have you guys heard of this new thing called TikTok? <laughs> well, maybe he's a little behind the times, but here at Hobby Farm Headquarters, we're on the forward edge of trends in chicken keeping. That's right. We were raising and talking about chickens long before it was cool. And even within our simple laid back avocation, there are lots of fads and trends. And we'll talk about them in just a few seconds. Whether we realize it or not, we all follow trends from time to time. Some more often than others. Right. Whether it's our clothes, hairstyles, or the cars we drive, we like to be fashionable. Well, at least we don't want to be too old-fashioned. And the world of hobby farming has its trends too. And to find hobby farming trends, you need look no further than backyard chicken flocks. Having a backyard flock itself has become quite trendy. Keeping chickens was already becoming increasingly popular. And during the pandemic of the last couple years, the number of people keeping chickens has exploded. And the more people there are doing one thing, the more you'll see different trends start to develop. Now, some of the trends we will talk about aren't exactly new, but they've become much more popular lately. And for the record, some of these trends we actually think are pretty cool, while others, uh, we can do without those. Now the first trend we'll talk about isn't really new, but the way it's being done has become trendy. I'm talking about building a flock that produces a colorful basket of eggs. Right. People have been doing this for years, but the latest trend is to have a flock that produces the greatest variety of colors, from the pure white to the darkest brown. This means certain breeds of chicken have become more popular as their eggs are among the most unique colors. Breeds like the Aracana with their blue eggs, Morans with dark brown eggs, and Ice Bars which lay moss green eggs are in greater demand now. I've got to admit, I think this trend is kind of cool, right? Because I've always liked the colorful basket, but getting all those breeds to get every possible color, it's just not going to happen for me. Of course, this next trend, it's definitely not for me. Yeah, Steve is talking about the popular trend of posting pictures of you with your chickens on social media. It was probably inevitable. With hundreds of millions of social media accounts and increasing numbers of backyard flocks, we shouldn't be surprised. It seems like every time I look at Facebook or Instagram, right, there's another person posting a chicken selfie. Even celebrities are doing it. Everyone from Martha Stewart to Jennifer Garner and Ed Sheeran. I have to believe that as long as social media and backyard chickens both remain popular, this is a trend that isn't going away. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised to see Eric posing with a chicken one of these days. Not likely. Maybe not. But if Eric does get a flock one day, I can see him definitely taking part in this next trend on our list. The upcycled chicken coop. Definitely. I'll admit, this is one trend the creative side of me really enjoys. Seeing all sorts of imaginative designs made from repurposed items. That's right up my alley. Yeah, we've seen everything from old furniture, trailers, swing sets, and even cars used to make creative chicken coops. As an added benefit, it can be inexpensive because you're using things you already have on hand. Some of the more elaborate ones can actually be impressive works of art, as well as being a functional chicken coop. So, I approve of this one. So do I. But one more trend I can't get behind is another idea that's been around for a long time, but has boomed recently. That is, naming your bird a famous name pun. You mean like Heidi Plume, or Cluck Norris, or Princess Leia, or Albert Einstein, or Kenneth Paltrow? Enough already. Yeah, many of these names aren't nearly as cute as people think they are, and often not too original. And a closely related trend is naming your chick after a chicken dish, like fajita, kung pao, cacciatore, similar to the celebrity name thing, but more palatable. Yeah, I see what you did there. Of course, we don't have to like the idea for you to enjoy it. If you're happy with Yolko Ono, go right ahead. And the final trend that's hot with backyard chicken keepers, ducks. That's right, ducks. For many people, once they have the chicken flock bug, ducks become the next addition to the yard. And why not? In many ways, they're just as much fun. They can produce eggs, meat, or be a pet and might even be cuter than those chickens. You can still post selfies on Instagram with them, 
build them an upcycled house, and even give them crazy pun names. Duck Norris, anyone? So those are five of the top trends we've been seeing in backyard chicken keeping. Quack Sparrow. Okay, Eric, everyone's got it. So what trends have you seen, or which are your favorites? James Pond. So if you have a topic you'd like to suggest, leave us a comment below, and don't forget to like the video and subscribe if for some reason you haven't already. Michael Quaxon. Happy hobby farming, everybody. Bye-bye. Benedict Cumberhatch.